Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome back to Keep Talking and Nobody Explodes. Sigh. What happened? Oh, what happened, what, Orbital? What the fuck's no, that all about? No, fucking hell. Ladles and jelly spoons. <laughs> welcome back to Keep Talking and Nobody Explodes. My name, of course, is Orbital Potato. I'm joined by Steve John Rhapsody. What happened? That was how it was supposed to go. It was supposed we rehearsed to go like this. that. But, well, you know what? I, I I was so depressed, right? Because this blinking lights <laughs> bollocks. Mm -hmm. Five modules, one strike, one minute thirty. The colors. It's okay, man. I believe Jelly spoon. I love it. Like, <laughs> that's the, the best shit ever. That's how uh, I'm going to introduce every single episode in Binding Isaac Rebirth. No, Afterbirth from now on. I don't care if they don't know who you are. Just that's how I'm going to do it. That's, that's I like out. it. Jesus Christ. Jesus, Jesus Christ. <laughs> fucking hell. Good I have no spoon. fucking idea how to do Morse code. I have literally no fucking idea. What the fuck's a jelly spoon? It's, it's, fucking th it's, it's a spoon you use for my eating jelly. Um, so what, <laughs> Is just, that not just a regular fucking All right, shut the fuck up, boys. All right? Got an odd number. We don't have... We've got a vowel. Okay, we've got a vowel. What does that mean? <laughs> We've got a vowel. Okay, that means the like they're just swapped. Blue, blue, and red are swapped. Green. Yellow and green are swapped. Oh, Go. Fucking hell. Oh, it's okay. I already exploded. That's, good I, job. I fucked up already. Okay, good work. Do you want to do the Morse code one? I think you'll be easy. Like, I think that'll be easier on you. No, no, it's okay. I'll do this one. Blue and red are swapped. Yellow and green uh -huh. are swapped. Easy. So, if he's just going to be doing that. How have you been, Steja? Fuck! I think he's dead. <laughs> Fucking hell. I don't know about that. He seems. <laughs> that seems like a good fuck. A good, well, is it a good fuck? A good fuck. A good yeah. fuck. Yeah. yeah. Oh god. Sometimes you have them, mate. I'm not sure. I'm not sure how you uh, <laughs> Shut the fuck sexual conquests have fuck been, up. but <laughs> Jesus Christ. Jesus fucking Christ. Sexual conquest. Just saying Sick. that makes me sound dirty. Yeah. De de describing almost anything as a conquest in this day and era is a little bit off color. Um, what about the the time that I took over the entirety of Parkhead? I would say that was a conquest. <laughs> wow, Parkhead. What's Parkhead? Uh, Parkhead. Parkhead's an area in East End of Glasgow. Oh right. See, these are references that I Sorry. wouldn't understand. Yeah. I wouldn't get that. Mm. I have no fucking idea where Parkhead is in Glasgow. <laughs> and I'm I'm from I'm from Scotland. It's Scotland. I, I, surprisingly, I Scotland is is a lot larger than most people would expect. And no, I do not know your auntie. <laughs> Why would you? Queen. She lives here. <laughs> how you, how you doing, potato? How's it going? I'm I'm doing all right actually. Yeah, I'm not doing too badly. Oh, cool. You actually still going? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's about my sixth try, but whatever. Oh, I thought we were just chatting shit for the sake of chatting shit. Oh, no, no, yeah. I'm just multitasking. Like a boss. Right. It's it's fine, dude. I believe in you. You've got this. Oh, my God. Five rolls on this fucking Simon Says? Yeah, that's why it's a problem. Anyway, Steve Joe, actually, Fuck asking shit. you how you are um, brings up a point about YouTubers and not being able to take time off. Because you're dosed to the tits on fucking sick medication at the moment, aren't you? Yeah, that's great. It's My legs are fuzzy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. It's the perfect headspace to record, you know. Yeah. Dayquil and Nyquil at the same time. Yeah. Well, it's, it's Nyquil and Tylenol, and the only reason it's Nyquil and not Dayquil is because I don't, I don't have any Dayquil. Yeah. You know what? Isn't Nyquil the one that's supposed to make you drowsy? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you that's why what? I'm drinking I... coffee as well. <laughs> <laughs> that that's probably really fucking bad for you, man. I, I yeah, agree, I'm but sad it is. <laughs> it's the only way that you could like actually fucking work. So, oh god damn it! Do I do I, for you, people? I, fuck. fuck. Yeah, exactly. Man. He suffers for his craft. That is like that's um, that's the thing about about YouTubers. Like you you don't get a day off unless you work it. Like I had. I I tell a lie because yesterday I had a day off. Eh, not yesterday. The day before I had a day off and didn't record, mm. and didn't have any videos going up and. Yeah, it's like, I just don't get paid for that day, like, and the issue yeah, is, fuck it's yeah. not that I just don't get paid for that day, 
it's that I just don't get paid for that day and subsequent days that people would have watched those videos. Yeah, yeah. Because mm -hmm. there's a long tail on videos. <clears throat> yeah, exactly. I, I just won't that, get paid for. In economic terms, that's called an opportunity cost, I'll have you know. It is, uh, well, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Except, except there was no opportunity. <laughs> it was a missed opportunity cost. It was all that, cost. That's a very, very good point. Yeah. God damn. I'm super lucky, actually, in that regard. I got back from PAX, don't have the PAX pox or the PAX plague or any of the convention illnesses that everyone gets. Yeah, but yeah. Australia is not like a real fucking country or anything. The PAX is probably fucking tiny. Oh. Yeah. Oh yeah, it was it was it was absolutely teensy <laughs> and sold out. <laughs> oh god! Oh. Why won't this fucking hell end? Like I've just been rolling with this for like mm -hmm. fucking ever. I'm trying to get to I'm trying to get to PAX next year. Oh nice! Which what, one you got? The real one, the big one. Yeah, the actual PAX. Yeah. The real one. This <laughs> fucking guy. <laughs> PAX East. PAX East. Well, Pax there's, there's, isn't Pax, Pax Prime the real one? Pax, Pax, Pax Prime is the real one, yeah. Pax Prime is the real one. If I can get to Pax Prime, I'd be super happy, but it might have to be Pax East. Yeah. But it just all depends on how holidays and stuff go. Yeah, that's fair enough. I can tell you, the good fun <laughs> is recording all of the episodes for the backlog before you leave. Oh, that's what it was like for Poland. Like, I, I worked like three 12 hour days. Mm -hmm. Jesus Christ. Yeah, like releasing eight episodes a day. Like, yeah, it, yeah, yeah. it kind of fucks I, you. Yeah, <clears throat> I have some insight into that. Not the eight episodes a day, but the twelve straight hours of recording. Yeah. Oh, geez, yeah. Before you went to PAX, you had to, or yeah, yeah, you had to record for a, a long ass time. Yeah, I was, I was doing that a bunch, but the problem is like. I feel like a quarter of it was for Darkest Dungeon, which I haven't even started putting on the fucking channel. Mm -hmm. Wow. Fashion project. Yeah, like, I think talking to some other YouTubers, we've all got those. We've all got, like, a series oh, play just because oh, we enjoy no. it. Mm. Oh, no. I was on the last one and I had 30 fucking seconds. Jesus oh, Christ. Dude. What? How did you get to the good fucking work? Yeah. You think he's? You think he's a dummy? He's not. You think? You think? I'm well, I mean, yeah, but just. I mean, I'm still surprised. <laughs> nah, it's fucking easy. You just need to get the mental switch around in your head, right? And you need mm. to roll lots of threes. Yeah, I rolled yeah. loads of fives. That was all so fun. It's okay. What if Orbital gets both of these this episode? Wow, were you doing were you doing like one at a time or were you? Yeah, yeah, I was doing one at a time. Oh, right, okay. So what? it's good to know that it's possible to do one at a time. Yeah, it is possible. Very okay. possible. Yeah, I was trying to double task him at the same time, but no, if you can do them one at a time, that's fuck. Yeah, because that's that was the conclusion I came to is that fuck. you can do it one at a time. No, you definitely can, but you just need to roll lots of threes. Threes, yeah. Okay. <clears throat> And you also need to make sure that you re-roll until you get one with a vowel well. in the word. In, yeah. Otherwise, it's just not fucking possible. Oh, I mean, if you, if you know the non vowel one, then I don't know. The non vowel one's just a little harder to remember. Yeah, it's just twisted round, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Well, green is itself, and the rest yeah. of the twist round. Which becomes a problem. It's a shame wow. that you can't intentionally get strikes to, like... Changes the pattern. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, Sneaky. man. I can't believe it. That one time I was so close and I c clicked red instead of blue. My heart was oh, literally man. pumping. <laughs> yeah. It was It was because I knew it was the last one and I knew that I was just, you know, very close to... Yeah. Pretty shit, but hey-ho. Life's a bitch <laughs> sometimes. I'm and then you die. I'm fucking retrying. Yeah, yeah, no, I've died probably around about 30 times this episode already. Isn't it life's a bitch? Life's a bitch, and then you die. And that's why we get high, because you never know when you're gonna go. Is that a song? That's a song, yeah. Which by one? whom? By who? Yeah. I think it's Nas. I don't know. Oh, Nas. Nice fucking no. Do you think I know music? I only know the lyrics. I don't know who sang them. <laughs> I'm just flipping through this fucking manual because we're useless. We're ancillary. We are. We basically have nothing. 
I, I, in the I'm, solving process here. I'm currently flicking through the upcoming releases on Steam to see what I'm going to cover next. <laughs> fuck off. All right. Jesus Christ. I'm going to do that as well. Yeah. Oh, fuck's sake. Fuck's I would, sake. I would change my recording setup so that you can see it, but yeah. My recording setup is set up so they can see it, actually. <laughs> oh, really? Is it just your screen? <laughs> you guys are It's assholes. just my screen for this one. These are absolute douchebags. I don't have a, I don't have a screen Wait. set up. I can't believe you know what? I always fucking did it. Jeez. I'm gonna just go through my queue. What do you think of Dead Realm? <laughs> that's Early the access game. horror. That's the game that's made by Syndicate and... Um, what's his name? The other guy. Um, Dead Realm, early access horror just... Uh, looking at the images, looks fucking alright. No, look, it, see this, there was there was a lot of stushy about this game, right? Um, because there was, you know, YouTuber, Tom Syndicate, and C Nanners, they uh -huh. are, they made it in conjunction oh. with the studio, and they don't disclose that they have a part in the project, so they may be biased or something. I don't fucking know. Yeah. yeah you know, I recall, I recall that scandal. They got they didn't fucking... disclose about that. Yeah, they didn't disclose. Oh, they were yeah. doing endorsing LPs of it without saying that they were part of the development. Yeah, this game is great. Everyone should buy this game. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Getting a cut of Fuck. It. Fucking scum. You know what? I, I, I will. I will happily say fucking scum to that. Hmm. Like, what do you guys think about the fact that I'm I'm just continually rerolling until I get something that's decent? Because at oh, the same dude, time, it's completely fine. Is it though? Because I've literally been yeah. doing that the entire fucking episode. Oh. Yeah. Football Manager 2016. Why the fuck was this recommended to me? I don't like sports or management or sim or football. I don't like any of these things. God. Because they paid for it to be recommended to you. You know what? I is wonder how, how much of that is going on. I really A do. lot, man. I don't imagine much of it is going on. Do you know what really winds me up about Steam? When games oh hit early, when he, games go into the coming soon thing, mm -hmm. and they're already oh. out. Fuck, 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 fuck. So it'll be like, it'll be like, upcoming game to Steam. It's like, uh, I'm looking at Gladiators Online. It's like, this game's been out for fucking ages. You can go to their website and play it. But Yeah, it's... It's, it's coming it's, out soon It's weird. They, yeah, because th there was a bunch of um, people that were, like, basically shoveling all of their past shitty cap. projects yeah. on Steam, so all of the newest releases were fucking back 2012, 2013. Yeah. Oh, that's such a douchebag move. bullshit. Yeah. I can't believe What do you think got... of Hyperdimension Neptunia V Rebirth 3 Generation? Uh, fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> can't even take that in to check it out, man. Okay, so... On their own page, they've included a screenshot that is literally from directly under one of the female enemies. Uh, nice. And it's a Japanese game, so I think you can understand where it's going with that. Yay. Why? Why would they? Does it sells? You know what it fucking does, apparently. Do you sense so? Ah, uh, the devil on G string. Nice. What? That's that's what this game is called. It's like an oh, anime thing. It looks like a dating sim, possibly. Potentially. Don't know, man. Don't know. What do you think about that craze where everyone went through and start like every so many big YouTubers were playing Honey Pop and having to censor out the actual like nipples and stuff? Why would you? But why nipples, would you do that? People go crazy. I know for, for the views. Yeah. Yeah. Like, the views. People go fucking mental for nips, but like, fuck. does fuck. that not fuck. feel a little? Fucking weird to be playing that kind of game as an LPL. I think well, so. Like, I like to play games that are good. Damn. <laughs> damn, I've just insulted so many people. I don't know if that game is good or not. And um, and yeah, this this episode's turned into a like, super story time episode. I mean, it can't be anything else, unfortunately, because Orbital is solving. No, so, well, no, no, no I'm not solving. Is. I'm failing. Although, I think I probably did get the furthest out of all of us. Like, yeah. I think so. I think I kind of gave up. I just need to roll some good threes, though. And so I how are you like an afterbirth, then? Oh, dude, it's fucking incredible. Yeah? 
Oh, I mean, there's so many bugs in it at the moment. Apparently, they're going to fix some of them in the next week. But as soon as that's can, as soon as those things are fixed, it will be just head and tails one of the best games that I played this year. I'm very tempted to get Afterbirth because, like I say, I do I do love Isaac, and it was the first game that I ever played in the channel. Mm. But I don't know, man. I might do a it's... week off and see how it goes. You know, what I'm tempted to do a week off, which off? by the time that this video comes out, I'll probably have already started it. Uh, fucking Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. Really? Yeah, like the old one. That's oh. that's probably my all-time favorite oh. game. Oh, god damn. See, I got like oh, 40 it. minutes into that game and I was like, I don't like party-based RPGs. And I was like, oh, fuck man. this. Man, I stops. kind of love it. I love it. How are you doing, Potato? Should be. I'm doing all right. You know, I'm not complaining. I'm just, I'm... Fuck. <laughs> No, <laughs> I'll do it one more time. I'll try it one more time. This could be the time. No, but any like any time I get near it, because I know it's so difficult, my my actual heart starts beating and it's really fucking distracting. Yeah, like it's I know how intense <laughs> this is and fuck your heart for beating. Fuck's sake. Oh my god, you're probably you're just probably beating it like a gazillion miles <laughs> an hour thanks to that uh, medication coffee combo. Ah uh, fuck. Oh, oh yeah, dude, your heart is going to explode in 21 minutes. Sorry, did I not tell you that? That's oh. gonna happen. Oh, we're at 16 minutes in this episode, so... Yeah. Close enough. That's yeah, okay, we can record it. another episode before you, you know, die. Of yeah. a massive Connor Rene. What, Connor, Connor Rene? Oh, fucking hell. Yeah, a, a Sean Connery. You're gonna touch a Sean, Sean Connery. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> Sometimes it's fine if your heart explodes. <laughs> <laughs> well, real man wouldn't care. <laughs> well, my real heart didn't explode every day. My heart didn't <laughs> fucking explode, but uh, my bomb did. Fucking. Oh, hell. I was so close. Let's just yeah. Okay, people, remember, remember me for how close I was, please. Please remember me. Remember, yeah. remember the fourth of November when. No, you remember, remember the fifth of November, the gunpowder treason and plot. And I know of no reason that the gunpowder treason should ever be forgot. How how do you know that? You're not even. You're not even a UK-based person. He's a colonist. What the fuck are you talking about? V He's for Vendetta, colonist. of course I know that shit. Oh, yeah, of course, of course. I'm a comic Great book film. nerd. Great film. Just I like the film as well. The fucking nerd. Anyway, <laughs> shut the fuck up. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> we're done here. My name is Inova the Potato. The douchebags' names have been Rhapsody and Steve Joe. Fucking They've rude. been talking about something that was completely irrelevant to the uh, episode. I hope you've enjoyed it. It's been quite good fun. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Adios.